Hi, good morning, everyone. As we take a live look in Waco this morning from our Baylor Scott and White Health Sky Live weather camera, we've got the cloudy conditions, even some low visibility trying to set up this morning. Plenty of humidity in place, 97% the latest humidity reading in Waco, 72 the temperature. So with the temperatures as warm as they are, the humidity as high as it is, and the wind speeds as light as they are, we could be dealing with some fog this morning. All those ingredients coming together to give us the fog chances this morning. So be on alert for that as you're traveling. Might have to take it slow from time to time. 76 by 8 a.m. at 84, I should say 84 degrees at noon today with a chance for some showers and thunderstorms. 5 o'clock temperature of 87 with another 50% chance for storms just like we had yesterday afternoon a very similar forecast out there for today now as far as what we can expect this morning looking at the radar we've got some spotty showers already starting to make their way into the area nothing severe very isolated most of us not going to see any rain out there this morning and most of this again is not severe so it's going to be very very light rain maybe a brief heavy downpour but i'm not expecting any heavy rain until later on today and then for your tuesday and wednesday and here's the reason why as we look at the satellite over our area just a few clouds out there this morning but i'm focusing on the satellite over the gulf of mexico we're watching this area right here. I have it highlighted for you. This is not a tropical storm yet, but it could become a tropical storm. 80% chance for tropical development with this system over the next 48 hours. The latest forecast models are pushing it right towards the Texas Gulf Coast. Now, as we look at this, this is all the forecast models, their tracks on the screen at the exact same time. So it gives us an idea of what the models are thinking. And you can see there is a good agreement with the models that is going to impact the Texas Gulf Coast. So therefore, we're gonna have to watch out for this because most of the models also push it to the north and eventually the northeast, which means it's going to impact us here in central Texas. Heavy rain looks to be very likely for your Tuesday and Wednesday. So we're starting out in the low 70s this morning. Here's the latest visibility map. I've been talking about the visibility for you all morning long to keep you updated. And we can see now it's starting to drop four miles in Hillsboro, five miles in Temple. And in Cameron, we've got dense fog already below a mile visibility. So please use caution. Take it slow this morning and give yourself a little extra time to make it to your destination. Shower and thunderstorm chances today more isolated. I think as we push towards the early morning hours of your Thursday, there'll be a few stray showers and then widespread shower and thunderstorm development as we make our way into your Tuesday afternoon and evening. Times of heavy rain possible. Take a look at what Future Track is showing for Tuesday night, especially down into the Brazos Valley. This is the tropical system that we have to watch out for. So we're going to be getting the remnants of that system, and that means heavy rainfall and some gusty winds for our area for your Tuesday and Wednesday. So I think it's very likely we'll get some flash flood watches issued from the National Weather service we're looking at anywhere from one to three inches of rain and isolated areas could get over four inches overall now it's not going to rain all week i think we're we'll start warming right back up into the 90s for the end of the work week and through the weekend that's the very latest weather information here jane and chris back to you